second speaker will be Professor, Associate Professor Abdel Fahid Natak. Uh, he is Secretary General of uh, our prestigious association, and he is a researcher and working in the area of Center for Fertility at Rabat, Morocco. He has been graduated from medicine at the University of Mohammed uh, V, Suisi, UMS 5S. He has a PhD in science in genetics, specializing in classical cytogenetics from the Department of Medical Genetic and National Institute of Health, Rabat, Morocco. He is a researcher in the IRT Archives Scientific uh, Group. Dr. Natit is a member of ASRM and ESHRI. He is founder of the Moroccan Society of Reproductive Medicine and the Moroccan Society of Fertility uh, Conception. Uh, Dr. Natit will give us a topic about genetics and of male infertility from karyotype to NGS. Please uh, start, Dr. Abdel Fahim. Thank you very much, uh, Professor Amr, for uh, this kind uh, uh, introduction. Uh, I would like first to thank uh, uh, ERIFIV RSG Association for this uh, uh, great uh, meeting. Uh, and I would like uh, also to thank you for introdu uh, introduce uh, genetics uh, for uh, like uh, topics in this uh, manifestation. So my, 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 my talk is about a genetics of male infertility from karyotype to NGS. We will say uh, uh, tools uh, of a diagnosis and uh, some manifestation of genetics male infertility. Like introduction, we can see that uh, infertility affects more than uh, 70 million people in the world. Mal factors contribute to over than 50% of the cases. And uh, there are uh, great heterogeneity of genetic causes of mal infertility going from chromosome abnorm abnormality Y chromosome microdeletion, gene disease, and more than uh, 100 gene involving in uh, mal infertility. There are also epigenetics alteration. For, for the etiology of mal infertility, there are quantitative abnormalities, 70%. Uh, subdivised between mechanical and obstruct obstructive and alterated production of uh, testicular failure. And for quantitative abnormality, 30% uh, sperm morphological defects or motility. For genetic causes of malinferity, we begin by chromosomal abnormalities, and karyotype is recommended in men with secretory azospermia or oligoastenoterato azospermia. In couple, if recurrent pregnancy loss, birth of abnormal children, or infertility of a couple, and also in RT assessment. And Solalia in uh, guideline on sexual and reproductive health 2020, they report they, that about more than 30% of patients with azospermia have abnormal karyotype. Now we show uh, the, the most common chromosomal disorder in men, syndrome of or clean filter syndrome is associated with hypogonadotropic, hypogonadism, and infertility. We can find it in, in homogeneous use or in mosaic. Uh, in second hand, the balanced chromosomal translocation are the most common structural rearrangements. Here 
we show translocation between seven chromosome and nine chromosome. Long, uh, and the individual affected by such translocation with failure of spermatogenesis because of meiosis impairments can lead to their recurrent pregnancy loss or a child with multiple congenital malformation. Another form or, uh, of mal infertility implicates in the chromosome is with the centric YQ chromosome. Here, a man with azospermia, uh, 39 years old, and we found a karyotype mosaic with uh, their Y chromosome. It is azo dysentery chromosome, and it is a common aberration of EY chromosome of most cases we report this abnormality in a mosaic. Uh, another form of uh, chromosomal abnormality involving in malinfertility, small supernumerary marker chromosome. This aberration affects on spermatogenesis and the prevalence of marker chromosome is three times higher in patient with infertility than in, in general population. And here, the groups, Thomas Lear groups, uh, uh, eminent cytogenetists in Germany, they report uh, a cases, two brothers, they have the same abnormality, chromosomal abnormality with marker chromosomic, one fertile and the other is sterile. They, the, the other is infertile, excuse me. Uh, uh, they, they conclude that the position of marker chromosomic in the area of spermatozoa can, can impact the spermatogenesis going from oligoastenospermia to azospermia, complex azospermia. Another form of mal infertility, microdeletion of Y chromosomes. This analysis is recommended in men if secretory azospermia or severe oligospermia, sure after normal karyotype. There are three regions in uh, uh, AZF there are E, B, and C, and the prognosis factor is. ICSI with microtesis by, but AZFE and B is unfavorable, but AZFC is favorable. Um, this, this abnormality uh, found de novo and 13% uh, of no obstructive azospermia and 6% of severe oligospermia. Here, just uh, electrophoresis from our lab to show you like, the deletion in B and the deletion here in B and C. Okay. Uh, Emmett Abor uh, reports uh, in uh, a famous uh, paper in Andrologia that after undergoing XC treatment, clinical pregnancy and live birth outcome rights with found to be 37% and 25% uh, respectively in groups of infertile male, 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 uh, infertile male, uh, 100, 1,200 infertile May. So, uh, we can see the rights of, of successful of uh, ICSI in Azidev C. Uh, now, is 
about uh, CFTRG, uh, the genetic of this uh, gene and this disease, the cystic fibrosis. About 98% of men affected with cystic fibrosis are infertile, characterized by congenital absence of vase difference, and when two at two percent male infertile and six percent obstructive azospermia. There are a lot of mutation, more than 1,300 in CFTR gene, and the most common mutation in CFTR gene is delta F580. Uh, and the American College of Obstetric Obstetrician and gynecologists report that this analysis or this the, the, the screening of CFTR for fibrocystis fibrosis can be offered to all patients regardless of ethnicity by a minimum panel of 23 common mutation. For the prognosis, there are extractory azospermia with normal spermatogenesis. The, the only option is epidemal sampling coupled with ICSI. And the genetic counseling is very important here regarding the mode of transmission of this, this pathology uh, autosomal recessive disease. Now we can talk uh, about tetrazospermia with particular phenotype on the spermocytogram. And here we underline the importance of spermocytogram for exploring male infertility. We began by macrocephalic and multiflagellar spermatozoa, or orcase mutation. Pierre Ray in Grenoble and uh, her group were the first to identify set th this uh, mutation. In 10, man, in 10 infertile men presenting this characteristic phenotype, and in all these men, they identified a common region of homozygosy arboring the ororachinase gene. All the patients who had a typical phenotype with high rates of large-headed spermatozoa were homozygous for this mutation. In our experience in lab, when we have more than 70 percent of macrocephalic and multiflagellar spermatozoa, we find this mutation. Here, I would like to, to, to share with you a paper that my colleague Sharqawi Jawad Iman published in 2009 about a consanguinity in Morocco and the effect of consanguinity in Morocco, the consanguinity is more than 15%, and uh, the frequency of ITL is 150. And uh, regarding this, this high prevalence of heterozygote, we don't, in, in our department, we don't see a lot of requests in in this mutation, and we ask where are the patients? We can dispute this point after. Here, just uh, a pick with uh, two sequence, normal sequence, and sequence with deletion in pos position one, uh, 100, 144. So is normal and deletion it represents 86% uh, of uh, this disease. And the, 
our colleague um, uh, Monsef Ben Khalifa published in 2012 a novel mutation in exon 6 that th this mutation represents 30 percent. For the prognosis, as we now or case protein involving, involved in chromosome segregation and cell division during meiosis, and the ORCA mutation stop of chromosome segregation. Therefore, they give polyploidy spermatozoid, and XC is contraindicated. Another form of malinfertility leading to uh, rounded headed spermatozoa, which is a rare disease and affects 0.1% of infertile men, characterized by the presence of in the ejaculate of rounded headed spermatozoa. Four gene and the, the most common mutation represents between 60 and 83 percent, DPY90L2. Spermatozoa have completed their meiosis. Uh, professor, you, you exceeded your time. If you can summarize the rest of the Okay, 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 okay. okay. Just uh, uh, for, the, for the prognosis, the only Fertility option in, in this patient is uh, is the ICSI, and they uh, Nailai reports a successful healthy children in case of total globozoospermia. Also in azo uh, acephalic spermatozoa, the uh, sense mutation caused the, this disease in 47 patients. There are also a novel candidate genes. And the only option also is ICSI. Here I will uh, pass in uh, the uh, last step, uh, new generation check sequencing and mal infertility. There are a lot of paper in uh, this topic. I chose uh, some of them. Here Xu uh, report a familiar study of twin with severe astenozoospermia, and they identify a homozygote mutation in SPAG17. This mutation can be a, a new pathogenic gene causing of astenozoospermia. Other group or other center of genetics chose to explore the um, malinfertility with panel gene regarding manifest clinic manifestation and uh, biological manifestation also. But there are uh, uh, panel of malinfertility of recurrent pregnancy loss of ovarian hyperstimulation syndrome. Uh, a nice paper uh, published, pu published with the Chinese group a uh, report that targeted NGS panel sequence could explain only two, more than 2% two by uh, panel 1, 5 gene, and 2% by panel 2, 12 gene of the patient with no obstructive azospermia after excluding karyotype abnormality and uh, Y chromosome microdeletion. The author suggests that only a few genes they are directly linked to meiosis, can indicate poor micro chase prognosis, such uh, TEX11, TEX14, and CA1. Um, last, uh, I will finish uh, soon, the last uh, slide. Uh, Nanan, uh, try to, to have answer at question, where are you going with gene screening for male infertility? They report and they conclude that karyotype abnormality and Y chromosome deletion and self mutation have been strongly linked to 
no obstructive azospermia and severe oligo azospermia, and CBA VD obstructive azospermia respectively. And they conclude they currently the NGS technology not for a diagnostic only, but for a research. Finally, we can see that spiromocytogram is a key role for in genetic exploring of mild infertility. Genetic tests in the context of mild infertility must be customized. And it is a very important to do counseling, genet genetic counseling before IRT procedure. And thank you for listening and welcome to Rabat. Thank you, Dr. Natik, for your excellent and nice presentation.